Hi everyone, Ethan Fieldman from Tutor Matching Service. So let's talk about some tutoring. So what does Tutor Matching Service do? Uh, we partner up with about 200 colleges and universities across the country and a bunch of international partners, and we provide a one-to-one -one tutoring website for them. So if you're looking for a tutor at uh, Clemson or Indiana University or University of Florida, and you'd like a college student to tutor your high school son or daughter, for example, we're the place to go. So Tutor Matching Service, we're a service provider to universities, uh, much like a private tutor list, but with technology. We manage the scheduling and the booking and the payments and all that kind of fun stuff so that the tutors can focus on being tutors. I've been a tutor myself for about 15 years. Um, started with uh, star athletes, athletic associations, making sure that the important athletes can, uh, can play in the bowl games, and then extended that and brought that incredible, expensive Shangri-La of tutoring to the general population of students. What we do is 100% free for the institution. Tutors sign up, they set their own prices, they get badges from the colleges and universities themselves. We do not provide badges, but our college and university partners do for certified tutors and high GPA tutors and things like that. We take 10% of the transaction. That's how we, uh, we make money and pay the bills. So 10% of all the money that's flowing as far as uh, students booking tutors, or, tutor, or students booking tutors, two T's booking tutors. Also, a lot of our tutoring is actually subsidized. So <clears throat> government organizations, Veterans Affairs, uh, TRIO, any types of programs like this can buy gift cards and vouchers and then subsidize tutoring for students. What's unique about that, though, is that when a student books a tutor with a voucher, the tutor doesn't know. The tutor just gets money in their bank account. They don't know that that student couldn't afford it. And that's a really neat, neat part of our program. 48 hours after the session is over, the money is deposited into the tutor's bank account. And again, we keep 10%. Uh, so this is an example of College of Charleston's website. If you Google College of Charleston Tutor, the very first thing that will come up on Google, even though we don't do, do any search engine optimization, first thing that comes up is a web page on the College of Charleston's website that talks about their partnership with Tutor Matching Service. And so, Again, if you're a college student looking for tutoring, or if you're a high school parent who lives anywhere in the country and you're looking for a tutor, the average price of a college student certified tutor is only about $15 an hour, one five. Much, much less expensive than things like Wiseant or uh, various websites you may find online. And there's two main reasons for that. One, we only take 10%. Whereas a normal tutor referral website takes about 40%. That's the going rate, 40%. Sometimes down to 30% if you're tutoring a lot. We take 10%. And there's an interesting adverse selection problem there where if you're a tutor and the website's taking 40% from you, if you're a really good tutor, you're not going to use the website anymore. So the websites are left with the worst tutors. Whereas for us, we're only taking 10%. We provide a mobile app. It gives you push notifications. It manages your schedule as a tutor, synchronizes with your calendar, does all this great stuff so you can focus on being a tutor and not worried about the business side of things. So the first thing is we take 10%. And the second reason is by working with colleges and universities, we don't have sales staff. We don't have business development. We don't have any of that, actually. We only work with the colleges and universities, and that brings in tutors and two Ts. A lot of people are Googling for tutors in their local communities or across the web, and they find us very quickly and easily on Google and such. When you go to the College of Charleston's website and you click to see their list of tutors, you see a simple list of tutors. You can see badges. You can see prices. You can see ratings. You can sort by availability or anything you want. So it's a, a very simple system, very easy to use. We also have an API that partners can use. So we actually send our tutors out to other websites, and we give them half of the 10% that we collect. So a lot of ed tech websites can't figure out how to monetize. They've got great resources, but they have no way to monetize. And so they've got traffic, and everybody's looking for a one-to-one -one tutor at some point. Typically, you, know, you try some kind of prep tool, but you want an hour with a tutor. So you can grab a tutor through our system through other folks' websites. That's our API. What's really exciting, what I really want to talk to you about, though, is GoBoard. So GoBoard is the first of its kind, simple to use, free one-to-one -one tutoring platform. So if you have a cousin or a nephew or a, an uncle and you want to do some tutoring online, GoBoard is what you should use. And I can tell you that because, like I said, I've been a tutor for 15 years. We met with Adobe Connect. We met with the head of Google Hangouts. We met with the, everybody you can find in the market to create a really easy-to-use, high-powered, really exciting cross-platform uh, tutoring platform just for simple one-to-one -one online tutoring, which seems relatively simple, but is actually quite difficult um, to make that simple. And we finally decided we had to build it ourselves. And so we worked with a bunch of universities and a whole bunch of tutors from different schools, and we built what is an absolutely incredible platform. You have video, you have one-to-one -one video, you can type chat, but that's really stupid, honestly. If, and if your webcam's not working, maybe, but you shouldn't be typing back and forth with a tutor. That's stupid. Any platform you guys see with typing back and forth as their primary method is not good tutoring, it's plain and simple. 
Also, we have built-in tools for building molecules. We have built-in tools for physics. We have a graphing calculator. We have a simple calculator. We have all the tools that you would need for tutoring. So you've got video in the top right. And listen to this. I'm a, I'm a 2T, OK? I've got a tutor somewhere. I've got a textbook. The tutor doesn't have the textbook in front of them. I've got work in front of me on my pen and paper. How do I get that to the tutor? Well, the answer is we've developed a system where you take a photo of it on any smartphone, any phone. You don't even have to have a smartphone. Any phone with a camera in it, you take a photo, you text it to the phone number on the screen, and it sticks that right on the screen for you so that both of you can draw on top of it in different colors. It works like a charm. Uh, universities are already adopting this to use for their online tutoring, for their distance education, and other programs, because a lot of colleges and universities want to use their own tutors who know the professors and know the content of that school. And so we work with a lot of distance education providers, university, colleges and universities, pretty much nonprofit is about all we work with, but, but open to other, other things. And so they use this platform with their own tutors to do online tutoring. But like I said, if you're just a, a parent and you have high school and middle school age kids, and you want to tutor for them, and you don't want to pay $100 an hour for uh, a Sylvan or something like that, you can get an online tutor who's certified and trained by a college or university in this country. And we're the only ones who do that work. So GoBoard's a fantastic platinum platform. We needed it for ourselves. We had to develop for, own, for our own business. And so we decided to release it to the world. And so now it's used by a lot of different organizations in several countries. Uh, so there's lots of tools built in. We're actually now running a large pilot with 10 universities to use iPad Pros with the Apple Pen and a smart keyboard. This is by far the best tutoring you can do online. At this point in time, it is an iPad Pro, 12 point, the big one, the 12 plus inch one, I, uh, Apple Pen, and a smart keyboard. And so we're piling this with 10 universities right now to, to replace all of their tutoring with this. Uh, it's really, obviously the hardware is a little bit expensive, but it's pretty fantastic. So if you're curious, feel free to grab me. So that's about it. If you ever want to talk about anything related to tutoring, especially online tutoring, uh, feel free to grab me. And thank you guys very much.